Hi, hi, I'm Michael. I'm Nash. And today we're going to teach you a game called Greedy Pig. Now, there's lots of different ways to play Greedy Pig. We're going to teach you our rules and um, the way we play it. So it's a very easy game. The only thing you need to play is paper, pencils, and a regular six-sided dice. Um, now, the way it works is we've ruled up a table for each of us that looks like that. So three columns, uh, round, score, and total. Um, and we've decided to play five rounds. That's the way we normally play. Some people play 10 rounds. You can extend it. You can shorten it, whatever you see fit. Okay, so the way we play is we roll the dice. And whatever number Ooh. comes up on the dice, that's how many points we get. So we both get five points. I'm going to keep going. So now we have a decision whether we keep going or we stop. If we keep going, we can earn more points. The problem is if you roll a two... The two is the number that will wipe out your entire score for that round. So if you roll a two and you're still playing, then your score for that round becomes a zero. So we're going to keep going and keeping going. Six. Keep so five plus six, you're going to keep going. I'm going to stop. Actually, yeah, I'm going to stop. Well, I'll... I don't want to keep... I want to stop because I don't want to... All right, you it. stop. I'll keep going. So what's your total, Nash? Five... Six. No, no, have a think. What's five plus six? Eleven. Yeah, goodbye. Okay, I'm going to keep going. And I go three. And I'll stop there. So five plus six is eleven, plus three more is fourteen. So I'm in front after the first round. Yeah. Okay, so now we move on to the next round. Nash, you can be the roller. <gasps> Great. Now, if our rule is if you roll a two on the first roll, it just doesn't count. So you both have to get started before the two can come up. Yeah. So roll again, Nashi. I'm going to keep going now. Uh, I'm going to keep going as well. Are you allowed to stop on the first roll? Yeah, you can stop on the first roll. <laughs> you going to roll? Yeah. Five. I'm going to keep going. Uh, I'm going to stop. So six plus five is 11, so I stop there. And now, Nashi, you're gonna keep going. I'm gonna stop. Okay, 11, so. 11, 12. Good job. All right, let's do third round, I'll roll. Ready? Six. I'm gonna keep going. Five. Three. I'm gonna keep going. I'm going to keep going as well. One. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep going. Three. I'm going to keep going. What are you doing? Stopping. Okay, I'm going to keep going. So you work out your total. I'll check in a second. Six. Twelve. Uh, no. Correct. Six, no, no. Six plus three plus three plus one more. Oh. Thirteen. Good boy. All right, I'm going to keep going. Plus one. Give me a two, please. I'm going to keep going. Give me a, give me a two. Plus four. Oh my god. I'm going to keep going. <gasps> plus two. Wait, two. So the way we report it, if you get a plus two, is we write the plus two, we put a big circle around it, and then we say <laughs> that my score for that round was a zero. <laughs> All right, so we fast forwarded, we've played round four, we're on to the final round. So Nashi, do you want to roll the first turn of the final yeah. round? Oh, that was a final. Yep, we'll count that three. So obviously this is a really fantastic game for probability, so working out the best time to stop, when you should keep going, when you should stop. It's also a really, keep rolling Nashi, it's also a really good game for, ah, ah. It's also a really good game for addition. All right, so we both got zeros then. All right, beautiful. So I'm gonna, I'll work out my final score first, Nashi. So I've got that an 11, six, and 11 plus nine is 20, 30, 34 is my final score. 30. All right, so Nashi, let's do, let's add up your tens first, so. 10, 20, 30, 40, I want to know. You already know you win, but let's see what your final score is. 40. 4. 40. 9. No, no, add count on 3. 44. 9. 9. Because 
No, no. So oh, it's yeah. 44 plus 3 more. 47. 47. 49. 50. Right down to 50 oh, there. That's your best score ever. So yeah, great game for probability, great game for mental addition as you're going through here. At the end when you're doing your final score, you can be doing uh, addition of two digit numbers as well. Really good game for young kids all the way up to older kids. Obviously there's different um, levels they can engage with the game. So that's Greedy Pig. We hope you enjoy it and thanks for playing.